Hello everybody and welcome to today's video. It's great to have you here today to learn more about how you can create a custom recipe on Everfit. So the first thing I want to share is where to find this feature. All you have to do is go onto libraries, click onto the recipe library on the left hand side. You'll then come to our pre-populated library of 500 plus recipes that you'll be able to use. To create your own custom recipe, what you have to do is go into the top right hand corner and you'll see the create new recipe button here. You'll then get a decision to make where you can add the recipe name, you can choose who the owner of, is of that recipe, and you can choose whether that's shared or private. So for this example, we're going to use pizza. You can also upload your own image. For this example, we'll use an AI generated image of a pizza and we can create. You'll be able to change any of the prep time, the cooking time, the servings, the dish type, the category, dietary information. So for this example, we might go pescatarian. You can add any ingredients as text or add ingredients straight from the ingredients library. Uh, the, the benefits of using the ingredients from the ingredients library is that it creates the shopping list for your clients on the client app, whereas adding it as text won't. So we can go ahead, add ingredients. These are fully customizable too. So I've added a custom ingredient of a pizza base. You can then add other ingredients like for a pizza, you might go for uh, mozzarella. You also might go for tomato paste. Oh, we'll go for tomato paste and you'll see that that will pop up on the right hand side. You can add that all in. You can even add an additional notes for your clients too. The instructions, so this is where you can add those step-by-step -step instructions. You can also add your own video through Vimeo or YouTube. Adding a step is as simple as clicking onto this button. You'll also be able to add images for those steps too. You'll see we have preparation and cooking instructions. The nutritional info, so this is where you can go ahead and add all of the breakdown of the macros and you'll see that fill up on this wheel here. You can also add the other nutrients, uh, so we have the more popular ones available here and then you can go on to more nutrients to add any extras too for your clients to see. Once this recipe is good to go, you can save it and then publish it. That will make it available for you to add to clients' individual client calendar but also to meal plans too. I hope this recipe was, I hope this recipe overview was helpful. If you have any questions, be sure to reach out.